I have some really good kids. Madera Unified Safety Officer Joe Zamilpa is used to protecting students at Madison Elementary. Every day. Every day. That's the only thing that's driving me to come to work. But last November, he and his partner Karen Mavrikas never imagined they'd be protecting an elderly couple from their burning home just down the street from campus. I kind of noticed a puff of smoke, kind of like a mushroom. And by the time we came basically a block down the road, the house was engulfed in flames. Cell phone video shows orange flames and gray smoke pouring out of the home on Stadium Drive. Karen kind of ran to the back. I was trying to open the door. I was banging on the door, banging on windows, trying to find something to break. They got into the home through the back to find an elderly couple in their 90s. So I'm trying to grab him. Karen's trying to deal with the wife, and they're both arguing with both of us about I'm not leaving until he leaves or I'm not leaving until she leaves. Um, and they, they were set stone stubborn that I'm not moving until one moves. By that time, the fire was raging. The fire was surrounding all of us. There was there was live wires going, popping, landing all over the place. Zamilpa says they got the couple out. Fortunately, they weren't seriously hurt, but they did lose a lot. They had money in the walls, their life savings in the walls. Zamilpa thinks about that day often. When I drive by it, I, I kind of play it back in my, my head, thinking, you know, what if I wasn't there? Zamilpa and Mavrikas have been nominated as heroes for the American Red Cross for rescuing the couple. I just was here at the right place, right time. In Madeira, Matt Mendes, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.